everyone. It's Jonas from Cold Outdoorsman. I'm taking a look at some clothes. It's, uh, it's winter now, and so we can finally start really talking about some stuff that'll keep you warmer. Uh, there's a company I've been following for the better part of a year. It's called Oros. Now, Oros is known for, uh, well, they had a Kickstarter campaign a couple of years ago, or a year and a half ago. And uh, they're taking aerogel, so that, that really thin, puffy, it's almost like, it truly is almost like air. Uh, it's what NASA uses to insulate their spacesuits. So Oros has taken that, uh, created their own special sauce, and they call it Solar Core. And it's their own version of aerogel, and they're putting it in some clothes. So I was curious, um, does aerogel, if it can keep astronauts warmer in space, uh, how's it going to keep me in the cold? So I haven't tested these yet, but I want to do a quick walkthrough of what they sent. Oros sent a couple of items, uh, both from their Orion line. If you look at uh, what they're coming out now with their spring line, that's different. It's the Rover series. But this is from the Orion line. It's out now for winter. Um, the first thing, and forgive me, I did open it, comes really creatively sealed uh, in a box. It's, again, it's a triangle. I think that's pretty slick. Just from a style standpoint, it's kind of nice to get something that's not a rectangle from time to time. Anyway, so the two items that they sent from their Orion series, one is a snow pan. And of course, when you're out there in the cold, your legs are going to get chilly. And so we always are used to wearing you know, big bulky sweat, uh, sweatpants underneath some, uh, another waterproof layer and whatnot. Oros promises that uh, these snow pants with their solar core are waterproof on the outside and insulated with a really thin layer of insulate from their solar core uh, to keep you from uh, being overly puffy but still staying warm and having that maximum mobility. So these are their snow pants. Um, again, they don't look overly bulky. Um, it's probably hard to tell on video, uh, but it's, it's snow pants. There's one leg, right? That's, and keep in mind, that's the, the front and the back. That's a pretty slim profile. Uh, I, can, I can feel the insulation in here. Uh, they do have a liner, so you can uh, really get that down there and keep the snow from digging up under, under the pants. There's a, oh, I would say maybe an eight inch zipper to accommodate boots. So that's a nice feature when you want to get those snow boots. The really bulky ones keep your feet nice and warm, whether it be a snow boot, a uh, ski boot, snowboarding boot, what have you. Uh, you can tell from the outside that it is definitely a waterproof material. Uh, it, this is pretty durable. But what's interesting about these is they look kind of like, uh, they look like snowboarding pants, not necessarily um, really insulated puffy pants, but, but they look they look like some, some normal bulky street pants essentially. Fashionable snap pockets here on the back, belt loops all the way around. It looks like they do have some adjustable waistbands, so you know, it's stretchy material, so if you're, if you just cinch it up a little bit, you're set to go. Snaps here with a normal zipper. And then fleece lining, apparently, uh, here at the belt line. That's a really nice feature. And then it, it seems like there's partially some, some thinner fleece here on the inside to really uh, dovetail with that solar core insulation. It doesn't seem like right here on the belt that it has the solar core, but definitely I can tell it has it here from basically right below the belt all the way down to the ankles. So I'm curious to taste, test these out in the snow and do a full review here in a bit. The other item Oro sent, which we've got the bottoms taken care of, is their top. And they have a jacket in the Orion series. I sent one of those as well. Much like the pants, the, uh, their jacket uses silver core for insulation. Let's open it up here. Now, I'm not a small guy. Um, I had to get an XL jacket, and, and here they were out of XL in black, so I got blue. That's fine. Uh, I'm more concerned about function than I am over form. In this case, I want to stay warm. Uh, I want to look good while I'm doing it if I can, but if I can't, I'm most concerned about warmth. But this is still, still a nice looking jacket. Uh, one of the things that's pretty slick about it is, as I said before, with that solar core, that's a very thin aerogel material. And so it actually has a 5 to 1 ratio uh, compared to down. It's five times uh, thinner 
than down for the one unit of, of similar heat. So when I mentioned about staying warm rather than worrying about how I look, I will admit sometimes I feel a bit on the bulky side with a puffy jacket. This is pretty thin. There is no mistaking that this is not a down jacket. Let's take a look here. I'm going to snap it and unzip it. I'll try it on. So, so snaps at the top and bottom of the coat. So keep that, keep that flat done. And the Velcro, obviously, you heard that being undone. Fully taped zippers here, full, full, full waterproof zippers. The exterior is supposed to be waterproof as well. That's good for uh, any melt. In a shoulder season, I'm curious if it would even actually work as a, a rain jacket, maybe not in a downpour, but in regular, uh, regular drizzle. So there we go. You can see it has thumb holes, so you can put those, put those right in into your gloves if you need to. Um, adjustable right on, on the side to accommodate gloves, tighten those up. Zippers here for um, ski passes or what have you. Uh, here on, the, on the, the, the chest pocket as well, maybe that's a smartphone. Again, all the zippers are lined here, or taped, so that's set. Lots of pockets inside. Um, there's the powder skirt here on the inside. It looks like it's removable, so you can take that out if you need to, and it snaps. And it feels warm. It actually feels uh, about like a puffy wood. So at any rate, uh, with Oros, I've got their snow pants and their new snow jacket. These are both from the Orion series. Uh, for the full review, head on over to coldoutdoorsman.com. Thank you.